So where are we this morning? Uh, we're at Netherhaven. And what are you going to be doing today? Um, we're going to be parachuting today. What do you uh, think is going to be happening during the day? Uh, well, a lot of training to undergo, six to eight hours. Yep, so that's um, fun. But obviously we'll be jumping from about 3,500 feet, so it's going to be brilliant. Are you, uh, are you feeling nervous at the moment? Um, not really. I probably will when I'm at the door, but looking forward to it at the moment. Yeah. All good, definitely. All good. One thousand, two thousand, three thousand, four thousand. Check. Canopy. Malfunction. malfunction. Look. Locate. Cut. Away. Reserve. Off. Well done. I'm coming back. Harder. Kick harder. Kick harder. Kick. Take control of your canopy. Look up for your toggles. Harder. Think someone really annoys you. Kick. Kick. Take control. Uh, so how have you found the, the training so far this morning? It's been quite intense, yeah. Physically hard? No. No? It will be, but okay. no, not yet. And, uh, and how long is it until you're jumping? About an hour, I think. And how, how, how are you feeling at this time? 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 4,000, It's quite hard to put into words. Um, Seriously, it's pretty, I don't, I don't know. But you, you know what you're going to be doing, yeah? You're fairly happy with your drills? Yeah, yeah, yeah. quite, quite, yeah. Good. Okay, James, uh, can you explain what's happening at the moment? Uh, so, basically, we've been delayed because, uh, as you might have been able to see, the weather is uh, not good. So, we're waiting for another half an hour to see if that clears. If it doesn't, we're going to have to come back on another day. Right, so, uh, we're in a variety of kit. Um, we got our case in here, uh, which is pretty much the top of the market. Uh, you know, it's, it's got uh, our main parachute. Um, the lower compartment there, and then a reserve in the slightly higher up, if you can see it back there. Uh, of course, because we're doing a static line, uh, you can see like the yellow rope there, it's going to pull, pull our main parachute for us. Uh, and as soon as that happens, the canopy will open, we'll be uh, you know, gliding down. Um, if we have any malfunctions, of course, uh, we will have to pull our reserve. Uh, we we'll total this, this, so uh, you might just need to, uh, you know, do 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 <laughs> Obviously, I'm not going to do that because that cuts away your main parachute. Uh, and then, of course, you grab this handle right here, interlocking your handle. Bam! Wham it straight down. Uh, and that will deploy your uh, explosive, some say, uh, reserve parachute. Now, on my left wrist here, I have my uh, altimeter, which is pretty rinky tinky, I think. Uh, can be adjusted. Yeah, mine, mine's slightly off, I will just adjust that slightly. Get it bang on uh, uh, zero feet. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. A lot other than this, uh, we've got our helmets. These are pretty nifty helmets, you know. Yeah, pretty cool. Uh, and in your helmet, you have a, a one way radio system which uh, plonks in the side there, like, like so. Uh, and then you can, uh, you know, get told what to do. Uh, and you just meander down, you know, just like that. And then you come in, you like. <laughs> Davy, how are you feeling at the moment? Tiny bit you look, you look the business. Describe a bit about um, what kind of training you've done today so far. All right, so uh, yeah, we've done a, a pretty varied uh, sessions. Yeah. Uh, range from sort of uh, just identifying parts of the parachute, that sort of thing. You know, going through certain parts, what they do, uh, to you know, uh, miss misfire procedure drills, I suppose you could call them. Uh, and then that all culminates in sort of a written exam, and then you sort of question your way through. Everyone breathes through the exam, it's pretty easy. Uh, yeah, we're pretty ready to, ready to go. And, and how are people feeling at the moment? The Atmo is the pretty good, you know? <laughs> the Atmo the is feeling, it's feeling solid, you know? <laughs> solid. Uh, solid. How are you guys feeling? Great. Yeah. There you go, you heard it from the man himself, <laughs> Zalfmeister General. He's ready. <laughs> Peace out. <laughs> Yeah. 
tell me how you're feeling at the moment. Uh, uh, a bit windy and a bit cold. A bit hungry. But apart from that, I think it's all right. How are you feeling? Literally going to fall out of a plane. <laughs> and it's kind of scary. <laughs> okay, girls, how are you feeling at the moment? How are you feeling? Absolutely terrified. How are you feeling? How are you feeling? <laughs> Gentlemen, how are you feeling at the moment? Yeah, excited. Give me a parachute, take me to the sky Just take me to the blue before I start to collide Get me a parachute, take me to the sun Would be a miracle to turn this world into one One, one, one Now tell me quick. Okay. How are you feeling at this time? I was pretty sick, you know. Uh, yeah, it's weird. As soon as your parachute opens, it's just like right. <laughs> yeah, it's really quiet out there. It's awesome. But they they dropped us. They dropped us about 500 meters too far that way. I see. Awesome. <laughs> Superb work. There's nothing we can do to get it back. Yeah. Wow. Whatsoever. Awesome work. Oh. Okay, oh, Ethan. So good. How was it, Ethan? Oh, so far that way. <laughs> yeah, I know. I was, I was literally coming down on that building. I had to turn this way. Oh, yeah. turn back. I did a spiral quickly just because I thought it would be fun. <laughs> Nearly yeah. landed on that barbed wire fence over there. <laughs> I saw you doing that. I saw you below me. I was like, not going there. So I went this way. I was like, oh, God. One by one we see the sun. Feel the day has just begun. Trembling lights up in the clouds All we need to feel is now as we go Give me a parachute, take me to the sky Just take me to the blue before So, uh, yeah, got 5,000 girls uh, just texting me now Seeing how I am Gonna tell them I'm okay I nearly uh, scratched me, uh, my buttocks to be honest uh, coming in over a barbed wire fence. Thought I wasn't going to make it, but I did. 